Alright everyone, welcome back to another Fallout 4 video. Today guys, I will be showing you location of the hazmat chute and a few other things like a 10mm pistol and some other cool little things. So guys, let's go straight to this. Now the location of this is a little far off. Okay, this is really far off actually. And it is in Hugo's Hole. <laughs> This thing, guys, is, let's say, over here, this is Vault 111, and here is Sanctuary. You're going to go all the way over to the right, I mean all the way over, and it's going to be within, like, see, right here is like an X, like a, not an X, but you know what I'm talking about. This is like a point. This is the main point where three roads lead into. It's to the left of it. It's like at the bottom of this pyramid shape thing right here. You're going to see it on your mini-map once you get close to this area. Once here, guys, you will need a pistol. Or some type of grenade. You will need Radex. And basically just a lot of stuff. So first off, you will run right here. There will be explosives and a turret. A Mark IV right down there. You will shoot one of the explosives on the wall. And it will destroy all of the mines. Tripwires. All of it. Then just pick off the turret at the end. You will then equip one Radex. And once you do, just run right through this whole area. Be super, super quick. And once over here, guys, there will be the hazmat suit to the left now pick this up you will get a hazmat suit which is going to be needed oh so much and at the bottom of the Tim right hand auto pistol uh you got mr handy model kit as well so this will be, be two videos actually because this is a location video for this thing because that people will be looking for this as well because the model kits are so cool in this just going to build this little guy they boom and let's see what this is this is Mr. Hugo's tape. The guys don't bother me anymore. That's good. I think it's... What was that? Can't they read the signs? I think it's time I go back inside the quarry. It's been too long. No. I can't. The guys would never let me in. I could kill them all. No. No, that would... That wouldn't be what it would want. It's time to lay down. Yes. Of course. It's next to my bed. I will. It's loaded. Okay. So, hmm. Something went on down here. Let's say that. This guy went crazy. And I don't know if he was talking about the hazmat suit or the pistol or something. But something was going on here. So let's pick this lock... I just got so lucky. <laughs> oh, I got lucky. Okay, so we got Tim Lunar round, 16 caps, a cushioned leg worth 29. Well, good. Now this, this is where it's at. A long Tim Lunar auto pistol. Now this is it. Okay, so basically we just got some good stuff. So let's go ahead and go through our inventory and let's look at this stuff while it's on us. So where is the um, actual hazmat suit? Here we go. This swing will increase um, radiation resistance up to a thousand. So basically, you won't get radiated at all. Um, where is the ten mm pistol? There it is. Let's do this one right here. It's worth more, and it's upgraded some. Oh, this thing is so good, guys. So good. So let's um, let's drop something. Let's drop a laser pistol. Is that enough? That is enough no it's not enough not even close anything over here that's a lot of weight um junk maybe i know i got a lot of this stuff Component no crystal why are crystals why i don't even know um leather i'm still learning this stuff and some things i need to build stuff so i don't know what to get rid of but let me just drop one of these um I want the raider. I don't want the military cap. Do I need that? No, I want something that's heavy. Uh, I want that as well. I'm trying to figure out something to drop, guys. Because all of this stuff's like worth it big time. Uh, let's drop this. I don't need no short pipe rifle. Institution pipe rifle. What else do we got in here? We want that. We want that action rifle. Yeah, that's worth too much. Here we go. We don't want this right here. Molotov cocktail. We still need five pounds. You know, whatever. I don't care. Let's just go over here. <laughs> get those rounds real quick. And that's it, guys. Let's look at our character, what it looks like. 
And basically, he looks like an astronaut, kind of. I'm not going to lie. He does look like an astronaut, in a sense. And it looks pretty, pretty cool. But everyone, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, drop some likes down below. Do I even need this short hunting rifle? Do I? What is it? Is it this is a double barrel. I don't need the double barrel. I don't never use it. It's not that good anymore anyways. There we go. So let's get out of this place. I want to test this gun out and see what it's all about. Oh! Oh! It's a three round burst! Okay, okay. I got you. That's pretty cool. So this gun is a three round burst. Oh my goodness. That is pretty, pretty sweet. I'm not going to lie, guys. Is there anything around here? Ooh, okay. This ain't good. Oh, no, it ain't. That's not good. Ooh, there we go. Okay, so it's good. <laughs> it's okay. It's real good. I'm sorry, guys. I'm making this video too long than it has to be. But, guys, that is the um, hazmat suit location with a 10 millimeter pistol, auto pistol with a long barrel. A few other cool things like the Mr. Handy um, collectible. So guys, hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, drop some likes, subscribe, and as always, this has been 2x2, and I'll see you next time.